So, um, as I said before, you're bound to get dirty. Nothing really on the back. It's mainly just the front. But my hair is done. And so, basically, I really only have a couple topics to talk about you. To talk about with you guys. Basically, you're going to get dirty. And the stuff is permanent, so be careful with the substances you get it on. And this dye will last about sometimes three days, sometimes even a week, depending on how much you wash your hair, which I wash mine every other day, so this would last me about four days, close to a week. Um, if this does completely go through and I get black hair, I might lose my phone <laughs> because I'm on fine if like it bleaches it, but if I go full black, it's gonna go black. Bam! <laughs> give me your phone. She's not gonna slap me or anything. She's gonna be like, "Give me your phone." Why'd you dye your hair? I'll be like, "It's cold night. It's cold night. It comes out in four days. Give me your phone." <laughs> so you know why? Um, but I'm just having up in a bun. My mom dyed her hair yesterday, so I don't know how long I gotta wait. I gotta wait 30 minutes. So let me guess up the timer. really sticky kind of but it doesn't really matter it just kind of means I mean it's Kool-Aid oh make sure that your Kool-Aid is sugar free so let me go check if mine was sugar free I really don't think it was but if it wasn't oh well I mean it's in my hair so wait let's see see if I can sweeten and sweeten yeah, I could that I use was unsweetened. So yeah, um, watch out for part three, which will be me showing you the results. So yeah, bye. Oh, and for brown, for like a dark brown hair, you'll have to wait about an hour. For hair color like me, 30 minutes. For blonde, like 10 or 15. I would go for 15 just to be sure. So, yeah. I am finding sugar crystals in my hair. Wow. Apparently this is sugar free. But, yeah. So, thank you guys for watching. Bye.